Hey, what's going on, you guys? We're back. We are at the regular season with the Halifax Buccaneers going up against the Chicago Blackhawks. Take it. We'll take one final look at our lines really quick. We got Ovechkin, Granlund, Perron, Dezingle, Backlund, and Hoffman. We've got the newcomer, 18-year-old David Finley on the third line left wing. We also got Matt Siemens on the third line center. He is a legitimate third line forward now. And Kasperi Kapanen on that right side of the third line. On our fourth, we got Como, Jamel Smith, Trevor Lewis, on D, Tori Krug, Eric Gustafson, Dylan DeMello, Jordan Osterley, Jay Bomeister, and Trevor Daly. And in net, we have apparently Eunice Corpusallo. <laughs> um, we're going to be playing half of the first game of the year. So you know what? Yeah, we want to go with Ranta and net. Absolutely 100%. Patrick McDonald has been sent back down to the Niagara Ice Dogs of the Ontario Hockey League. So we will be checking in on him as time goes on. Let's view the draft class this year. Aiden Nouse, Oliver Dupuy, both in the draft. There might be another one I'm missing right now. Aiden Nouse is projected third overall. The 17-year-old for the Sudbury Wolves in eight games has nine points as a playmaker on that right wing. He's currently being scouted. So, oh, what has happened? What is happening? I don't want to view the watch list. I want to watch list them. All right, so pin. There we go. Now let's look for anybody else. Oliver Dupuy projected to go ninth. Holy. I didn't think he was going to go that early. He's got four points in seven games in the QMJHL playing for Ramuski. Leadership ability is his best strength. He's got no weakness. The Grinder. They're saying he's two years out from the NHL, just like Rock Mantha. Oh, are we going for him? Will it show me last year? He had 46 points last year in 65 games in Ramuski, plus six, 44 penalty minutes, 179 shots taken. Let's look at his advanced stats a little better here. Time on ice. So he was on the second line last year, and he's on the first line this year. He had zero hits, zero blocks, zero giveaways, zero takeaways. <laughs> I forgot they got no advanced stats, but he actually had a pretty decent season for Ramuski last year. Let's see how Aiden Naus looked. Nine points so far this year. He's on the top line for the Wolves. He had 58 points for the Wolves. He was a plus 18 last year. 11 power play points. Great special teams player. He's been on the top line both years. Not a face-off guy. They don't have the uh, real advanced stats there. But honestly, I think he's he could have an 80-point 80 80 point season in the minors. Do we have anybody else created this year? Uh, let's see. I'm trying to remember who all we had, but I'm not th I don't think there's any other created people. I think that was it. But I think what we're going to do now... Obviously, we're going to watch those two. Aiden now, it's Oliver Dupuy. But what we're going to do right now... Uh, I'm going to go to view lines now that we're in the regular season. And first things last, we're going to look at the Washington Capitals who are not playing Darren McDonald right now. Do they have him scratched? No, they don't. So the Washington Capitals have sent Darren McDonald down back to Niagara to be with Patrick McDonald this season. All righty. So that takes care of that. Where was the next guy we got? Cameron McDonald is a second liner for the Toronto Maple Leafs right now. Look at the Leafs lineup. Where? Oh, where? Oh, yeah, we have Kasperi Kavan, and I was going to say, what happened there? Come on now. But Cameron McDonald on that second line for the Toronto Maple Leafs. On my team, apparently, he fits pretty well on line three. He's got one year left under contract. One year left, and then he'll be signing his first legitimate NHL contract. We'll go to the Ottawa Senators 
and we're going to look at Ryan Chisholm, who is a legitimate starting goaltender. Still has two years left on his rookie contract. Absolutely phenomenal goalie. Last year in his rookie year, he had a 9-11 save percentage, a 272 goals against average, one shutout in 61 games, 34-23-2. This year in the preseason, ooh, much less good stats in the preseason this year, but they did not have their uh, legitimate team out. All right, so now we move on to the starting lineup of the Chicago Blackhawks, where Ethan Bryant is a third-line center for the Chicago Blackhawks. The 2019 13th overall pick, playmaking center. Ethan Bryant, two years left in his contract as well. You remember he had 28 goals, 17 assists, 45 points in his rookie season, and 4 points in the preseason. Look at that. He had 27 shots in 5 games in the preseason. So... This kid, not afraid to throw the puck on net. Not afraid. I don't think I'm missing anybody. There is a chance I'm missing somebody, and if I did, I am very, very sorry about that. But I want to see really quick, before we go too far here, view the draft board. I do want to see. Those are the two guys we got. Uh, projected picks. We have that one first-round draft pick. They're saying it'll probably be around the... 14th draft pick but we can pick up uh, a draft pick or two in the meantime I'm thinking really quick before we jump into the game I'm gonna try and move Kalorn and maybe get a draft pick for Kalorn because uh, <clears throat> Alex Kalorn is not gonna play this year um, who do we got who's a rebuilder Chicago is a rebuilding team apparently and we have to face Chicago. <laughs> uh, contender. They're a hopeful. Uh, they would be able to take them on. Draft picks. Uh, try and go for their first round draft pick. And um, I'll give them next year's second and the following year's fourth. We'll see if they'll go for that. I might even be able to get away with that without the fourth. Trade rejected. Uh, <clears throat> let's see. Um, what if I was to retain uh, $750,000 and throw in a second and a seventh? I feel like that's more than fair. Come on now, Columbus. Thank you. I know everybody's everybody's angry. I traded away Alex Kalorn. Really didn't have any room for him. All right, so we'll go to our settings very quickly. We're going to turn injuries back on. I turned injuries off just for the preseason. And now, yeah, injuries back on. Period length, five minutes, difficulty, all-star. Let's get into this season, people. So now we have two first-round draft picks for the upcoming draft. I uh, have no idea what they're going to look like. I have no idea what Halifax is going to look like. After the first period, we are up 2 to nothing. It is Alex Ovechkin and Michael Backlund getting the two goals for us. My goodness. All right. Uh, as we're in the game, 3 nothing. Ovi gets another one. 4 nothing. It's David Perron. Holy. The Buccaneers attack, but we're shorthanded going into this game. Oh, my goodness. I meant to change the captains around, too. I do not want Michael Backlund as our captain. <laughs> I'd rather give it to Ovechkin. I would rather make Ovi our captain for the next two years. Oh, my goodness. Come on, people. All right, loading. Let's get into this game. I'm, I'm so jacked. It's like, how am I going to lose this one? You know? How am I going to lose this game? <laughs> I'll find a way. Anyway, we are in their zone. Trevor Lewis. Has David Finley right beside him, but we just couldn't take that face off. All right, so Bo Meester back on defense. Stay in, I like to play this style. Stay close to the guy you're watching. Get out in front, Bo Meester. Get out in front, baby. Duncan Key. Oh, Bo Meester gets the stick in there. What a beauty. All right, Trevor Lewis gets the puck. Let's just get... Oh, tried to get rid of it. Just couldn't do it. Missed the net. Osterly got caught chasing. Here's Dave Finley. 
Oh, what a beautiful play, and Rant is going to cover that up. We're going to hold on to that. No, 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 no. We're not, let's not be heroes, right? And we got Michael Backlund out for the second penalty kill line. They got Kirby Dock with Alex Nylander and Andrew Shaw. There we go. Why is Tori Krug on the penalty kill? He's an offensive defenseman. Can't put him in front of the net. He doesn't take up any space. It's pretty bad when Matt Siemens is back here playing defense. All right. And DeMello's out of the box. Get her up to Matt Siemens. Matt Siemens rushing down the ice. Shawzi's on him. Oh, taking away the eyes. Jamel Smith almost puts that one in. Michael Backlund's going to take out Bockfist. Jamel Smith keeps it in. Right out in front. Backlund, what a save by Hutton. Oh, my God. We're going to get that top line back out there. And, you know, we'll go with the third defensive pairing. <coughs> Ovechkin. Is he going to get a hat trick in his debut? Oh, my goodness. Wins the draw. Ovi. Oh, nope. Just throws it in front because you're stuck in that animation. No good at all. Boom Easter. <laughs> I love it. I love it. Just play smart. Stay back, Trevor. Oh, Ovi gets it back. The great eight. Proven he's still great. Even though he's like 38. The great 38. Let's get it to Ovi. Whoop. Nope. Ah, son of a... Oh, you cherry picker. Ethan Bryant. <laughs> We're playing against Ethan we're playing against Ethan. Get it up to Ovi. Oh, Ovi just couldn't control it. Oh, we need to get that second line out there soon. Or the third. Ovechkin, what a steal. Are they on a bad change? Ovi's moving in the zone. Backhander can't get the hat trick goal. Ryan Dezingle's getting back on that defensive change. Oh, Tori Krug, where were you, baby? Hold on to that anti ranta Oh, my goodness. I can't believe it. Ethan Bryant, we're going to get that... That top defensive pairing, we got to get him back out a little bit. I kind of feel like I want to alter our special teams just the slightest little bit. Let's win another face-off. Nope. Ryan Dezingle, nope. Tori Krug, get back. Stay in front of that net. Stay in front of the net. Guard that slot. Hassel Hoffman, here we go. Ryan Dezingle. Uh, what's he going to do with it? He's going to hold it. Get it back to the point. Tori Krug on the point. Just wind and fire, baby. Wind and fire. Eric Gustafson way too far back. Oh, and Michael Backlund, what a move. Ryan Dezingle gets it. Back to Backlund. Backlund to Tori Krug. Oh, Tori Krug, the little man. The little man. Right out in front. Here's Gustafson. Back to Tori Krug. Oh, right out in front to Hoffman. Puck protection, puck protection, puck protection. Back to the point guy. Tori Krug can't get it off. Hoffman keeps it in. Hoffman does not keep it in. No! <laughs> Tori Krug's getting back, though. Tori Krug's getting back, though. Here's Murphy. Chilly, or Killian Murphy or Cillian Murphy or whatever his stupid name is. Oh, Patrick Kane just can't dump it in. Matt Siemens gets it out. And the period's over. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Woo! So, we remain in the lead. Four to nothing. Anti Ranta is proving that he is 100% in game shape right now. But the third period is coming. That tends to be... When the other team really turns it on, it's us against Dylan Stroman. Granlin's going to win that every day. Oh, he tries to pass it to Eric Gustafson, but he forgets that he's a defenseman and he jumps right up in the play, just same as Tori Krug. We got to, like, edit strategies or something. Yeah, I think I forgot to edit the strategies. There comes Ovi, grade 8. Grade 8. Just fire it on the net. Carter Hutton, nice save. Oh, Adam Bockvist in behind. Here's David Perron again playing defense because the defense doesn't want to. No one's staying really too far back. Oh, he gets it across. And Gustafson with a great play. Ovi just dumps her down. And let's get the second line on the ice. I say, don't you tell me it was a bad change now. Jordan Osterley, beautiful play, but they get it back. Osterley still got it. He gets it up the ice to Hassel Hoffman. Who had a 30 goal season last year, but Carter Hutton is there to stop that one. Let's keep that second line out. Hoffman, Backlund, Dezingle. I really truly believe this line could get pretty deadly for us. This line could be deadly. You know what I'm kind of thinking I want to do for this season and all seasons coming? Put out more videos more often, but play more games. 
this one every 10, it's like I have no control, you know? It's like it, it really feels like I have no control. So maybe I'll play uh, like highlighted games or something. I don't know. We'll figure something out. Hoffman again into the zone. Oh, stopping up. Still got the puck. Coming around. Get it back to the point guy. Dylan DeMello. Oh, back to Hoffman, but he threw... <laughs> that was a bad place to throw that puck, right? I, I am not even joking, though, guys. These jerseys. How gorgeous are these jerseys? I am super proud of these jerseys. Uh, toss it around the net. That was really dangerous and really risky, and I probably shouldn't have. Dave Finley up to Matt Siemens. Come on, Matty! Come on, Matt! Use your wheels, buddy! Get it across! Oh, I was actually really hoping he was going to throw a pass across. Get it over to Dave Finley. Dave Finley could get his... First career NHL goals, uh, goal, sorry. Also, I think, oh, nice win, nice win. Gets it over to Dave Finley, the little man, the little man. Gets it over to Trevor Daly with a shot in front. Siemens with a shot and a nice stop by Carter Hutton. Come on, Siemens says, let's go, baby. Let's go. Let's go, Murphy. All right, baby. Oh, oh, he takes one. No, you're not going to hit me. I'm going to hit you back. Oh, come on. You're not going to hit me. You're not going to hit me, baby. Come on, Matty boy. Oh, the uppercut. Oh, he's tricky. This guy's like dodging everything right now. Oh, nice uppercut by Matt. This is just a back and forth. Oh, he tossed me. You pansy. You tossed me. Ah. Uh, I hate it when they judo toss you, man. That is so cheap. Oh, God, I hate that. Ah. Uh, so line three. You know what? We're in their zone. We're gonna we're gonna toss that top line out. Ovi, Granlin, Perron. We're in the third period. Kajula, Bryant, and Quenville are on the ice. We're going up against Ethan Bryant right now. Oh, and we lost the draw. That's bad. Oh, Perron. Perron over to Krug. Krug winds and fires. Nice play. Pinch Gus. Oh, you shouldn't have pinched Gus, but it's okay. Ovi's back. Ovi's back to play D. Ovi's back. Cover that slot. Oh, Ovi, what a beauty. Oh, Ethan, Ethan Bryan almost uh, almost just created something really amazing there, and that's going to be an icing call. Ovi just, just could not get over to that. We got 10 minutes and 39 seconds left in this game. Mikhail Granlin on the draw with great eight. Alex Ovechkin and a nice win back to Tori Krug. Oh, I tried to toss it. It didn't work. Stromer, oh, I can't move. <laughs> great eight, can you sneak around? You got no speed, Ovi. Back to the point guy, back to the point guy, uh, point guy, no, it didn't get over to the, didn't get over to the winger, nice play by Krug, he's really giving Adam Bockfist a hard time here, yes, turn around, <laughs> oh, great play up to Kasperi Kapanen, who's in the zone, Kapanen, deadly backhanders this year, we're not going to pinch this time, we're not, pin oh, apparently we are pinching because I can't freaking select Trevor Daly, Oh, that drives me nuts. Oh, Patrick Kane. Kasperi Kapanen gets it over to Dave Finley. Dave Finley in the zone. And, yeah, Buddy's just not coming, eh? Oh, my goodness. The only thing I don't like about this game is sometimes your guys really don't want to do what you ask them to. Like, you, I, you have a hard time, like, turning around and... Oh, as if that just went in. Come on, man. Dylan Strom. Dylan Strom, come on. You know what, we'll get that fourth line out. We'll get that third defensive pairing out. We got to get these boys some minutes or they're going to get upset. We're up 4-1, to one. it's all right. 4-1, to one. six and a half minutes left in the game. That goal was 100% fluky. All right, so we got Blake Como. Como's just going to whip that one. Oh, I meant to whip it around the net, not at the net. Jamel Smith. Hanging back a little bit. Or Trevor Daly just standing there. Bo Meester crosses over for no reason. Oh, Trevor Lewis, what a beauty. Just dump it. John, dump and chase. Get the fuck out of here. We're going to get that second, second offensive line out. Oh, I'm trying to throw hits and it won't let me. Jonathan Taves. Oh, Backlund almost steals that one right out in front to Shaw Boy. Oh, Shawzy, you're, oh, Hoffman, you're breaking my heart, boys, you're breaking my heart, what a beautiful play, Backlund, gets it up to Hassel Hoffman, 
Hassel Hoffman in the zone, winds and fires, and he scores! Hoffman with his first of the year, I think. Look at that beauty. There's Jack. Jack the Sparrow. <laughs> Hassel Hoffman with his first goal of the season. What a snipe over the shoulder of Carter Hutton. Matt Seaman's back. No injury on that fight. Take the draw. It's all right. Wear it, wear it like a badge of honor. Michael Backlund with a point. Oh, Matt Siemens loses that puck. They got these active sticks, man. Carpenter says no. Osterley kind of sneaks through. Dave Finley gets it up to Kasperi Kapanen, who fires. Nice save. Beautiful play by Matt Siemens. Oh, I almost thought he was going to steal it right in front of the net. All right. All right. We're getting back into our own zone. Beautiful play. Kasperi Kapanen. Oh, and he gets leveled by Drake Kajula. Matt Siemens not happy about that. Oh my goodness, it's bouncing around right in front of the net. <laughs> All right, come on, come on, come on. Matt Siemens, just get it out. Dave Finley, the little man, he's got no wheels left at all. Just wire it on net. And we're gonna get that second pairing out. We gotta go up against Vegas, the Rangers, and the Yotes. All right, is there any other games really worthwhile coming up for us in the next little while there very well could be we shall see michael backland win loses the draw against ethan bryant oh backland that was a little late baby that was maybe a little bit late boom easter watching john quenville right here he's watching quenville oh right in front hassel hoffman get gone baby can he get his second of the night no he can't Oh, I didn't mean to do that. I had my finger on the pass button. I didn't mean to actually press it. Ah, uh, here's Bomey in front of the net. Oh, Jay Bomeister. Beautiful play. Beautiful play. Backlund gets in the way but can't block it. Bomeister, another beautiful play. Yeah, we're... Oh, what a giveaway. Ethan Bryant takes it away right in front. And a nice stop by Antti Ranta. Trevor Daly with a great, oh, defensive play, and then ignores the puck, but the game is over. We win the first game of the season, and we're going to take a really quick look at this box score. We outshot them 31-28. to Perron, Ovechkin, Backlund, all the stars of the game. So Ovi by Perron, Backlund by Hoffman and Dezingle, Ovechkin again by Perron and Dezingle, Perron by Tori Krug, and Hoffman by Backland and Jordan Osterley. Anti Ranta with a phenomenal game tonight. Here we go, boys. So I'm going to simulate. Uh, what I'm going to do <clears throat> in the next video probably is uh, do a slow simulation of the next couple of games until we find a meaningful one. It probably won't take very long. Uh, hold on now. Uh, we're going to go to the calendar really quick, and I'm going to see, I'm going to look and see what games we got coming up in the near future. <clears throat> you know what? Right now, I think really quickly, I am going to simulate up until the Nashville Predators game, and we're going to play the home game. There you go. <clears throat> so really quickly, right now, going to simulate ahead. And we're going to play against the Predators. We've gained locker room chemistry. We're going to go simulate game. This is what we're going to do. We're going to slow sim these games really quick. Get to the Nashville game. And that's where we'll be next time. Down one nothing. Cody Glass with his NHL debut this season. It's 1-1 one one and it's Ovechkin again. Third period. We win 3-1. It's Granlin and Bomeister. We got outshot 44-24. All events go to goals. Ovechkin, Perron, and crew. Granlin, Perron, and Ovechkin, and Bomeister and Backland. We are 2-0-0 to start the season. Holy David Perron. And I think, honestly, the more games that we actually play this season, the better our team will do. So we're going to simulate this one as well. <clears throat> we're going to simulate this one. If this ends up being just a ton of fun, here we go. All right, two to two. Blake Como, so bottom six goal. We like to see that. Capo Caco gets one on Antti Ranta. Tori Krug with his first of the year. Second period, we're up three to two. Tori Krug again. And in the third period, six to two. Ovechkin with a double. 
Oh my goodness. <clears throat> Tori Krug by Ovi and Granlund. Como, Lewis and Smith. Krug, Dezingle and Eric Gustafson. Ovi with his fourth by Krug. Ovi with his fifth by Granlin and Krug. Granlin with his second by Ovi and Perron. Alex Ovechkin, the great eight. Somebody make this kid the captain already. David Finley gaining morale. We got one more game to go. We're 3-0-0. Oh, oh. I am like loving this right now. Then I'm going to simulate. Oh. You know what? We're going to simulate this one game. Then I'm going to view the draft class. See if we have any updated information. Oh, baby. Oh, baby. Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna what we're gonna do is we're gonna put up a lot more hockey videos. Oh my god, look at this. Ovi with two more. Hoffman with one. It's three to one after one. Four to two after two. Uh, Mikhail Granlin with his third of the year. And it's oh five to four victory. So we are four zero oh, and oh to start the year. We got Ovi by Granlin. Hoffman to Zingle and Backlund. Ovi with his seventh! By Granlin to Trevor Daly. Granlin with his third by Ovechkin and Krug. And Krug by Granlin and Ovechkin. This top line is working, man. This top line is out of control. Ovi, 12 points in four games. My God. So I think what we might end up doing, guys, is we might end up like... I'm trying to think of what we maybe play every fifth game or every fourth game or something. So that way we get a fair amount of games played. I think the next episode I'm going to play two games. So I'm going to play against Nashville. Uh, I might play against Carolina. First thing we're going to do here is go to the draft class. We got to view this draft class. Uh, we got no new information on Aiden Nose. This Matty Lackinen. This kid. Wow. Based on these grades, I would honestly put him at like 76, 75 or 76, maybe 77. Yeah, NHL ready, but he's probably uh, depth defense. Aiden House, 10 points in 11 games. So his production slowed down a little bit. Uh, let's see how Oliver Dupuy is looking. Seven points in nine games for Oliver Dupuy on that top line. Still, the leadership ability two years out from the NHL is that if we grab Oliver Dupuy, is this kid going to become like assistant captain material? Is he going to do it? You know? Alrighty, boys. I can't believe the start to the season we're having right now. So, honestly, you know what? Uh, let's take a peek at our total uh, team stats right now so top line absolutely getting it done second line getting it done third line and fourth line not getting it done at the moment Matt Siemens Dave Finley both held without a point right now absolutely best locker room chemistry Matt Siemens David Finley Keep these kids together, man. Keep them together. Keep them happy. Matt Seaman's only playing 10 minutes, 40 seconds a night. That is unacceptable. Dave Finley playing 16 and a half minutes a night. All right, so we are first going to go to the Chicago Blackhawks to see that Ethan Bryant is currently three assists in five games. He's a plus three. He's taken one penalty. The 20-year-old playmaker is finally learning how to pass. And in his career, why is this not loading? Why aren't you loading, man? What are you doing, baby? Why can't I load his career stats? This is kind of freaking me out a little bit. Stuff is like saving or something right now. It's really it's kind of freaking me out. I kind of want to save the game right now. Wow, this is freaky, man. Freaky. Anyway, we'll get back to that. Uh, we're going to go to, where does everybody play again? Oh yeah, we're going to go to the Toronto Maple Leafs. Nothing is loading. What is happening? Go back. It won't even let me go back right now. What's happening? Uh, no. <laughs> oh, why is it freezing on me? All right, you know what? We're going to end the video there. I just hope to God it actually saved everything. This is really freaking me out and stressing me out, guys. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Uh, as always, 
Uh, like and subscribe. There's going to be more videos coming out really, really, really soon. I, uh, until then, guys, have a good one. Fingers crossed that this is not broken.